it's just beginning because this is not the end. Only on eight, one family's emotional plea for your help after a new clue is found which could bring them closure. And I'm Orko Mana. Some CCSD students will soon be leaving their kitchens to go back to the classroom. I'll tell you when. We're tracking our next round of rain. <laughs> I'm sorry, and it's not too far away. We'll show you the timing of that storm coming up. Five. This is 8 News Now, 5 at 11. The Valley's news leader. Good evening. Tonight, a family is pleading for others to help them find some closure after a terrible accident. And now, a new clue in that investigation might help. Thanks for joining us. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Brian Loftus. Rennick Lambie was hit and killed back in November while riding home on his motorized scooter. It happened on Abel's Lane, right near Lake Mead and Lamb. Sasha Loftus spoke with Rennick's wife and son, and she joins us now live to share their message in a story you'll only see on 8 News Now. Sasha? Denise and Brian, this is the exact spot where Rennick Lambie lost his life back in November. Now you can see his family has created this memorial for him, but they tell me they can't truly honor him until they found out, find out who did this. Someone, you know, took my husband away from me. And, you know, it's hard for me every single day. 76 days.